到了不同的地方。So Gop Kumar, uh, by the power of his mantra, he was able to go to the heavenly planets, and when he was in the heavenly planets, he was given the position of Indra, the king of heaven. 他唱诵这首 mantra 就去了天堂。Mm, but he was not satisfied there. He didn't find the 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 great pleasure which he expected he would get. But he was not satisfied there. He didn't find the the great pleasure which he expected he would get. But he was not satisfied there. He didn't find the 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 他看到天堂的半神人们，有的时候呢会彼此争吵，有不同的意见。And then it happened that some great sages came from the higher planets, and Gop Kumar became curious to know about these higher planets. 这时候就从更高的星球来了一些伟大的圣者们，恐怕库马尔就对这个更高的星宿呢感兴趣了。So above above the heavenly planets, there are four planets in the universe. 在天堂，嗯，之上呢，还有四个宇宙中的,的更高的星系。So, Gop Kumar began to think about this higher planet, and by the power of the mantra, he immediately went there, and he he found himself on a planet called Mahaloka. 所以 Gop Kumar 呢，就想着这些高等星系，然后他发现他们念了 mantra 之后，就置身在 Mahaloka 上。So in Maharloka, he found all the great sages there were engaged in sacrifice, and they were all exper. They were, they were uh, surrounded by great opulence, and they had uh, everything material desire you could desire materially. Gopal Kumar found that in Maharloka, these great sages were engaged in sacrifice. 那里有巨大的物质财富。So the sages there on Mahaloka, they would perform sacrifices for the pleasure of the Lord, and then when they were making the sacrifice, from the fire of the sacrifice, the Lord would appear and accept their offerings. 这些圣者们就嗯为满足主，就举行了盛大的祭祀，就从祭祀的火焰当中，主亲自就显现出来了。But Gop Kumar experienced that at the at, at the start of the sacrifice, when the Lord would appear, they'd feel very happy. Then, um, when the Lord appeared, they'd feel very happy. But at the end of the sacrifice, the Lord would disappear, and then all the would disappear, and then they'd all the they would feel great unhappiness. So by the end of the sacrifice, the Lord of the sacrifice, Lord Yag, the Lord would disappear. But because he was controlled by the devotees, he he would not be invisible for long. In the sacrifice, after the 至尊主就消失的无影无踪了，但是因为他被他控制，奉献者控制着，所以他消失的时间不会很长。But that little fraction of feeling of un unhappiness, that that unhappiness which came in the mind of Gop Kumar, that became the seed of desire to find an even better place than this Maharloka. 就是因为他呢，嗯，心里的这一点点的不快乐，就种下了种子，他为他日后寻找更多的快乐种下了种子。So Gop Kumar was there、uh, on the, this higher planet, and one day was one thousand one thousand cycles of the four ages. 在高等星系。一天就是一千个年代之和的循环。So in the course of time,、uh, he was forced to to go 
to another planet called Janaloka, which is above Maharloka. Mm. The Mahaloka is it, it stays in ex, it's in existence for the same duration of time as the planet of Lord Brahma. But Mahaloka is near to the heavenly planets. And the heavenly planets, they experience the heat which comes at the time of the annihilation when the lower part of the universe is annihilated. The fire which destroys the lower planets creates a heat which is felt even in the heavenly planets. So in order to escape from that intense heat coming from the fire of the planets in the lower part of the universe, the inhabitants of Maharloka, they would go to the next higher planet, they would go up to Janaloka. Now on Maharloka, the sages were always performing sacrifices there. Everywhere Gopkumar went, every home, they were doing some sacrifice, they were doing a yagya. But on Janaloka, it was like coming into night, it was like night time because no sacrifices were being performed. And then, in addition to that, Gop Kumar was feeling the pain of not being able to see the Lord of Sacrifice. So that pain of not being able to see the Lord was even greater than the pain of the heat from the lower planets. No, there's no actual night in Janaloka. Janaloka is Janaloka is it's self effulgent. That means it's always in the light of the sun. It's always daytime. But Lord Brahma sometimes goes to sleep. And when he goes to sleep, he goes to sleep along with Lord Garbhodakashai Vishnu. And at that time, the lower planets, they merge into the ocean at the bottom of the universe. So that means there's no more sacrifices and all the ordinary activities also come to an end. So when they're not doing any more sacrifice, then the Lord of Sacrifice, Lord Vishnu, doesn't appear anymore there. So that's very painful for Gop Kumar. Gop Kumar is very attached to seeing the Lord and being with him. So 
So at that time, Gop Kumar was thinking, he was thinking it's better to go and see Lord Jagannath because before he'd been in Jagannath Puri and he'd been able to see Lord Jagannath every day. Lord Jagannath's home is Jagannath Puri and it's protected by the shade of a, a big banyan tree. And even when, when the sky and the heaven and earth are all destroyed, Jagannath Puri remains untouched. So Gop Kumar returned to Maharloka and he chanted his japa in meditation. And when he did his chanting, then he felt very sad and he, he awakened the desire that he could again be in Vrindavan. So Gop Kumar always thinks of Vrindavan as his, this, this, this land, the place in which he is from. And Gop Kumar is also, he's narrating this story, he's telling to, to a Brahmana who is in Vrindavan. And so his separation from Gop Kumar's separation from Lord Vishnu didn't last for a very long time. It was only a short time. But he was always remembering Vrindavan, and that was more serious. That, that, that had a greater effect on him than any of the happiness he had in the heavenly, in the higher planets. Sometimes he could forget the desire to go to Jagannath Puri, but he could not give up his attraction for Vrindavan. That was even greater than his attraction for Jagannath Puri. But then Lord Vishnu would again appear at the object because they were, the, the sacrifice would be performed. And so he would appear and he'd call me with, he would call Gop Kumar and he would eat whatever Gop Kumar had brought for offering to him. And Gop Kumar seeing Lord Vishnu, then he would forget all of his distress, just like the sun drives away darkness. So Gop Kumar was so attached to the Lord that he wouldn't go anywhere else. Even at night, he just simply remained there, he wanted to be where the Lord appeared. So he knew in the night he's not going to see the Lord, they're not doing the yajna in the night. But Gop Kumar was so absorbed that the thought of the Lord that, that he, he forgot the pain of being separate from him during the night. 
，所以主就不会显现。但是，嗯、但但是勾巴库马尔，他他对，因为对主的思念就，就他一直还在思念着主。So during the daytime, he wouldn't think to go anywhere else. He would just be, he would just stay at that place where they're doing the sacrifice. 在日间，勾巴库马尔哪儿也不去，只待在。Because there he's able to see Lord Vishnu, and they're having, they're worshiping him, and they're obtaining his mercy. Because he is just there, he can see Lord Vishnu. Because people are worshiping Lord Vishnu. So even during the night of Brahma, Gopakumar is still there. So even during the night of Brahma, Gopakumar is still there. He, he had. The, he wanted to enjoy this sight, this worship, and this mercy. 即便是在 Brahma 的黑夜，勾帕库马尔仍然希望享受的看见主，崇拜主带来的欢乐。So this was Gopakum. This Gopakum had this desire constantly. 勾帕库马尔内心恒常有这种愿望。So it happened that while he was there at Mahaloka, someone arrived from a higher planet. 有一天，当戈帕库马尔在马哈洛克上，来自有有一些人来自更高的星球来了。And his form was surrounded; he was effulgent; it was glowing with light. 嗯，他浑身散发着光灿，他熠熠生辉。And At the same time, his his he appeared to be naked. 但是，嗯，同时呢，他看上去像是赤身裸体的。He appeared to be just a five or six year old boy. 他看似是六七岁的小男孩。So the the people of Mahaloka, they often travel to this other planet, Janaloka. 马哈洛克上面的人们经常旅行到詹纳洛克。The two planets are very close to each other. 这两个星球很近。But there's one difference between them. 但是他们却有一个区别。On Janna Loka, the fire of annihilation from below, the fire which comes from below, is far enough away. That there's no need to go anywhere else. This difference is in Jana Loka. The fire of destruction is very far away, so they don't need to go to any other place. On Maha Loka, that's not far enough away, and on Maha Loka, they feel the heat, and that's when they go to Jana Loka. On Maha Loka. 的距离还不够远，遥远，他们还能感受到灼热，因此他们要去詹纳洛克。So Gop Kumar he knew about this, he'd experienced this. Gop Kumar 很清楚，因为他有切身的体验。So the next world for him to see, because Gop Kumar wants to see everything in the universe. So the next world, the next place which he wanted to see, was Tapaloka. 因为勾帕库马尔想要去体验所有的世世界，他下一个目的地是塔帕洛卡。So now he's going to hear about Tapa Loka because this person, this five or six year old boy who is not dressed, not body is not covered in any clothing, is just naked. He's come from Tapa Loka. 接下来他就会聆到聆听到塔帕洛卡。因为这位六七岁的赤身裸体的小男孩将要讲述塔帕洛卡。So Gop Kumar he'd never heard the Tapa Loka, so he just saw this this boy, the young boy, and he was told he's from a higher planet. Gop Kumar 从来没听说过塔帕洛卡，他只是知道这个小男孩是来自更高的星系。So it's normal for little children, five-year-old children. It's it's not unnatural for them to go naked. Ah, 对于五岁的大的小男孩子，嗯，赤身裸体呢是很自然，再自然不过的了
So there was nothing so much unusual in this, seeing a little child naked. So we have to understand who is this little child. So when this little boy appeared, all the great sages, they put aside all of the implements, all the things which they were doing the rituals with, and they stood up with devotion and they bowed down to this boy. And they, 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 they were worshipping this little boy like he was the Lord of Sac, like he was Lord Vishnu himself. But this little child just remained undisturbed. He was in meditation. But, but the great sages, they were led by Brigo Muni. Brigo Muni was one of the sons of Brahma, and they were all respecting this little boy. So Gop Kumar was very puzzled to see all of this. Who is this little boy and what's this higher place which he's come from? So the little boy didn't stay there long. He, he just came there and after some time he went away. So when he left, then Gob Kumar asked the, the great sages, he asked them, who was that boy and where did he come from? And why is it great souls like you, you great sages, why, why you are worshipping him? So this little boy was so special that no, there was no force which could stop him from going wherever he wanted. So he came there on Maharloka suddenly and he left there just as suddenly. So Gop Kumar was very puzzled to see all this. Because he saw the great sages on Mahaloka that they were being worshipped by the demigods. And the sages were worshipping Lord Vishnu in person. So how is it this other little boy could command so much respect from the sages? And they even stopped their sacrifice in order to honor him. So the sages have to reply to Gop Kumar's questions. So they said that person is Sanat Kumar and he is the eldest amongst all of us, and he is the greatest. And he's the first, he's the first teacher of all the great sages. And he's a lifetime celibate. And his desires are always fulfilled. So 
So the the residents, the, mo the most important residents on Maharloka are sons of Brahma. People like Brigamuni. Brigamuni. And so, 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 so Sanat Kumar, he is their brother, but, and he's the eldest of Lord Brahma's sons. And he's better than the other sages. He's different from them because he never entered family life. Even though his father, Lord Brahma, had requested him, he never did it. And so this was the answer to the first question asked by Gop Kumar. He had asked who was he? So now he this, now he knows who was he. 这边是对Gopakumar第一个询问, and then we're told he lives in the world above our world above Maharloka, he's in the higher planet above Maharloka. He's in a place called Tapaloka. And he lives there with three brothers and with other great yogis who, like him, are masters of yoga. 他和他的其他三个兄弟一起就居住在这个星球上。那个星球上的居民都是伟大的瑜伽师。So Gob Kumar had asked, like, where did he come from? So th this was replied here in this question. Gob Kumar, 嗯，问的第二问题是，他来自何方？这边是答案。and he's not the only one like him, there, but there are three brothers who are just like him, just as great as he is. Yeah, you have, he, he, is, he was Sanat Kumar, and the three brothers, one is Sanaka, one is Sanandan, and one is Sanatan. Sanak, Sanaka, Sananda, Sanatana. Yeah, good. So these four brothers live on Tapaloka with the other great yogis. And people, people like Kavi and Havi and Antariksha. Havi, Havi, Antariksha. Prabuddha. Prabuddha. Pipalayana. Pipalayana. These are all great mystics who live up there on Tapaloka. So to go there, you have to, you have to be strictly celibate, fully celibate. And so the people who live there, their semen always flows upwards. So they feel constant peace and happiness, millions of times greater than what's enjoyed by other people in the universe. Tamagandao uh Huan Tamagan Ping Hu Tamaganda Kwala Yapi Chita Di Fan Kwala Yokao Shang Bai So this the four Kumaras and the other people there on that planet they've made the vow of lifelong uh celibacy. Kumar Sindi Hu so some people they observe celibacy after 
enjoying first first they want to they take part in sexual relationships but then after some time then they give it up and then they practice celibacy. 有些人是先享受, 嗯, and then they enter in some people will practice brahmacharya and then they will enter into married life. Oh, you see, I'm not So some people they practice brahmacharya their whole life, they never marry. So both kinds of celibacy are very good. But it's only a very rare person who is very determined who can give up all sex for the entire life. So these are the people who get to go to Tapaloka. So on Tapaloka, everything is auspicious there. There's no trouble from the heat of the time of annihilation. And the people who live there, they don't need to go to a higher planet. Uh, so when the three worlds at the bottom of the universe, the three worlds, three pl planetary systems in the bottom of the universe, when they are destroyed, the people on Tapaloka don't even notice it. So, when the three worlds in the bottom of the universe so the yogis who are living on Tapaloka, they enjoy undisturbed peace and satisfaction. So,啊，这是。This is being described here by the great sages. The sages on Mahaloka, they're saying that especially for householders like us, these people from the Tapaloka, they're worthy of our worship. Just like we worship Lord Vishnu, who is the Lord of Sacrifice, these people are also worthy of our worship because they've given up all material duties. So in this way, the sages answer Gop Kumar's question about why they worshipped him. So Sanat Kumara is honoured throughout the universe because he's a representative of the Supreme Lord. Sanat Kumar is a representative of the Supreme Lord. And he's considered an incarnation of the Lord. And he's a very prominent Vaishnava devotee. So the people in Mahaloka, they gave great respect to him because he was their, he was their uh, very special guest and he's a very strict brahmachari. So if somebody can observe strict celibacy, then he is considered superior, he is considered better than those of Grihastas. So 
你谁要是严格的真手生。就被认视为是要比呃居士 g r a s t 要更高高等。But we should also understand that these sages who live on Mahaloka, that they are not ordinary householders. 但是要明白，居住在马哈洛克上的居嗯圣者们不是普通的居士。They have they have very little attachment to home or property or other material things. 他们对家庭，嗯，对其他的财产只有很少的依附。So Gop Kumar heard their replies, and then he said to them, he said, "Ah,、uh, Gop Kumar says, 'I, I, I wondered what kind of planet, what kind of happiness do they enjoy on this place, Tapaloka?'" 当哥哥帕库马尔听完这番回答，他再次询问说，在塔帕洛克上面，他们享受的是何什么样的快乐？何种快乐呢 ？And are there any more like this Sanat Kumar, like this boy? Are there others like him? 其他人是跟这个 Sanat Kumar 这个小男孩都一样吗 ？And what kind of lord do they worship? 他们崇拜的是什么样的主？ So, Gob Kumar had heard the sages answer his first questions. 嗯，哥帕库马尔嗯，听到了圣者们对他第一个问题的回答。So this way, Gob Kumar is getting inspired to go to Tapaloka. 哥帕库马尔这样就被激励着想去塔帕洛卡。Actually, Gob Kumar's main interest he wants to see. The Lord of the Universe. He wants to see Lord Vishnu. Gopal Kumar 首要的兴趣就是见到宇宙之主 Vishnu. But still, he he thought it's important to go there to Tapaloka. 但是他仍然认为去塔帕洛卡也很重要 And his thinking, Gopal Kumar's thinking, is that if this person, the Sanat Kumar. And the others on the planet like him, if they have opulences like those of God, then what what form of God are they worshiping? It must be even more wonderful and opulent than they are. Gopal Kumar's thought is. 嗯，像这塔帕洛克上面的人，像呃萨纳库马尔这样的人，倘若他们的形体呢，就跟神一样，那么他们所崇拜的主，肯定一定要比他们本本身要更加奇妙。So Gop Kumar was eager to see the situation there on Tapaloka. Gop Kumar 便渴望见到。塔帕洛克上面的处境。He wanted to see all these people. 他想见到这些人。So he chanted his mantra very carefully. 他很小心的念诵他的 mantra. And quickly he traveled to Tapaloka. 他迅速旅行到了塔帕洛克。Gop Kumar he wanted to go there to see Sanat Kumar and to see his brothers. Gopal Kumar 想渴望目睹 Sanat Kumar 及其兄弟。And he also wanted to see the Lord whom they are worshiping. 他也想目睹这些人崇拜的主。So he focused his mind on that aim. 他就一心一意想着这样的目标。He turned his attention inward, and he imitated Sanat Kumar. 他把注意力。转向内在，他模仿 Sanat Kumar. So because he had seen Sanat Kumar absorbed in deep meditation. 因为他见到 Sanat Kumar 处在深深的冥想状态。So Gop Kumar is doing also meditation. Gop Kumar 也开始冥想。So by the mantra, he was able to get that same power, and he was able to transfer himself to Tapaloka. 借着 mantra 的力量 ，mantra 的力量，他也可以将自己转移到塔帕洛卡
Do you want? Who wants to go to Tapaloka? 那你们谁想去塔巴洛克呢？啊<笑><笑>、huh? ，It sounds good. <笑><笑>好 ，K， 所以 Gop Kumar got to Tapaloka and he saw Sanat Kumar and he saw the also the his brothers Sanaka, Sanandan and Sanatan. Gop Kumar 就旅行到了塔帕洛卡，他于是见到了四兄弟 Sanaka, Sana, Sanandan, Sanatan. So, Sanat Kumar. Yeah, all the, he saw all the residents, all the other people on Tapaloka. They all appeared similar to the Kumars. The four, they looked like the four Kumars. Tapaloka 上面其他的居民样貌，嗯，都长得貌似 Kumar 四兄弟。And they were all, but they were honoring the four brothers. 他们仍然在尊敬这四兄弟。And the, the the four Kumaras, they were engaged. At, they were enjoying themselves, having a a big discussion, and they were discussing something very complex, which couldn't be understood by persons. Gop Kumar said he couldn't understand what they were talking about. Four 兄弟津津乐津津有味的在讨论着一个深邃的主题。Gopa Kumar, he couldn't understand. So the people on Tapaloka, they're also worshipable. Tapaloka, 上面的人们，嗯，也是值得崇拜的。They're like the four Kumars. In other words, they're like little children, and they're all naked. They all look like little children, and they're all naked. They all look like little children, and they're all naked. They're like they're also empowered representatives of Krishna. 嗯，他们都是被赋予力量的 Krishna 的代表。So when Gop Kumar first saw them, they were having a big philosophical discussion. Gop Kumar 第一眼见到他们的时候，他们正在进行深邃的哲学讨论。These kind of things are discussed in. The tenth canto, chapter eighty-seven of the Srimad Bhagavatam. These topics are the Srimad Bhagavatam, the tenth canto, eighty-seven of the Srimad Bhagavatam. It's a chapter called "Prayers by the Personified Vedas." The eighty-seventh canto of the Srimad Bhagavatam is a chapter called "Prayers by the Personified Vedas." 是第十篇当中的最著最长的一一章。If you read the Krishna book, you can see it's a very long chapter. 如果你们看《Krishna 快乐全言》，发现这一章非常长。So they're discussing there about the, the nature of the absolute truth. 他们就在上面那里讨论绝对真理的本质。So Gop Kumar, he's just a simple cowherd boy from Govardhan. He didn't have much education, so he couldn't understand much what they were talking about. Gop Kumar, because he's from Govardhan, is a simple cowherd boy, so he couldn't understand much. He didn't understand about liberation and devotional service. He didn't understand about liberation and devotional service. So the the people in Tapaloka they didn't have any kind of、uh, distinguishing features to show that they were the supreme. 在塔帕洛克洛克的人们，并没有什么显著的特征表现表明他们是至尊至尊者。But Gop Kumar says just by seeing the people, especially the brothers in Tapaloka, he felt. Intense, spontaneous joy. Gopa Kumar said, "He just by seeing these Tapaloka people, he felt intense joy." Now, usually, Gopa Kumar only got his happiness when he would see the Supreme Lord. Usually, 
。只有在见到至尊主的时候，勾帕库马尔才在感到快乐。Like when he would go to Jagannath Puri to see Lord Jagannath. 比如他去扎纳普瑞见到主扎纳纳的时候 ，Or when they perform a sacrifice, the Lord would appear from the yagya and accept the offering. 或者是在祭祀场上，当祭祀举行的时候，主显现接受祭祀的时候。But this time, he's he's feeling happiness just to see the the people like the Kumaras. 但这一次。他一见到像库马尔这样的人们，他就感到快乐。He feels happiness because he knows the four Kumaras are very intimately connected with the Lord. 他之所以感到快乐，是因为他知道库马尔四兄弟和主有着很亲密的连，嗯，关系。Even though the Kumaras they don't have four arms, they're not like Lord Vishnu. They just have two arm forms. 即便库马尔四兄弟只只是有着两臂，没有不像威士奴有四臂。And they didn't display any of his infinite powers. 他也没有展示出无穷无尽的力量。But because of the greatness of Tapaloka, and seeing Sanat Kumar and his brothers, there was so much happiness for Gop Kumar. 嗯，但但是只因为嗯，这个库马尔斯兄弟有着。Even more happiness than he experienced when he first saw Sanat Kumar on Mahaloka. 呃，即甚至要高过他在 Mahaloka 上第一眼见到 Sanat Kumar 的时候。So the because of the the place, seeing the person in the right place makes it more glorious. He felt more happiness. 只是因为见到。库马尔斯兄弟在自己的嗯居所，这就更加荣耀了。So then Gop Kumar saw that all these people on Tapaloka, they all went to do their different, they went to their different places to do their meditation. Gop Gop Kumar, 嗯，发现四兄弟都开始进入到冥想。So Gop Kumar wanted, he was searching. To find out where where is the Lord of the Universe? Gopa Kumar is searching for the Lord of the Universe. Because when the when the Kumaras 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 讨论结束之后，他们都回到各自的地方。他们都有各自的居居居所。So Gob Kumar was just left on his own. So he began to think also about the Lord of the Universe. Gob Kumar 就孤零零的一个人留在那里。他不禁又思念起宇宙之主。Because when he was on heavenly planets, he had seen the Lord of the Universe, and when he went to Maharloka, also. The Lord would be visible there as well. Because in heaven, he can see the Lord himself. But in the Mahaloka, he can also see the Lord himself. So he thought Tapaloka must also be here. Where is the Lord of the Universe? So he thought Tapaloka must also be here. Where is the Lord of the Universe? So he thought Tapaloka must also be here. Where is the Lord of the Universe? So he thought Tapaloka must also be here. Where is the Lord of the Universe? So he thought Tapaloka must also be here. Where is the Lord of the Universe? So he thought Tapaloka must also be here. Where is the Lord of the Universe? So he thought Tapaloka must also be here. Where is the Lord of the Universe? So he thought Tapaloka must also be here. Where is the Lord of the Universe? So he thought Tapaloka must also be here. Where is the Lord of the Universe? So he thought Tapaloka must also be here. Where is the Lord of the Universe? So he thought Tapaloka must also be here. Where is the Lord of the Universe? So he thought Tapaloka must also be here. Where is the Lord of the Universe? So he thought Tapaloka must also be here. Gopa Kumar 便开始四下的寻找、打听，到哪里可以找到主。So he had no time to ask anything because at first the four Kumaras they had received the worship of the sages. 他没有时间，嗯，提出呃发问，因为首先呢，四兄弟受到了崇拜。And immediately after that, everyone went into trance. 其后呢，每个人都立刻就进入到了神定。So Gop Kumar couldn't find the Lord of the Universe. He couldn't see the Supreme Lord anywhere. Gop Kumar, because because he couldn't see the Supreme Lord, he couldn't see the Supreme Lord anywhere. 
and he would come before the different people and he would they, he would offer obeisances and prayers to them mm. and, and they did not even look at Gopkumar. Gopakumar Everyone there was fixed in Samadhi. They were completely self-satisfied. And they're fully celibate their whole life. And they're, they, they, they have nothing to achieve. They're not anxious to get any kind of perfection. Sometimes the people of Tapaloka may meet together and have a philosophical discussion. Sometimes they may worship the Supreme Lord. But the rest of the time, they just engage themselves in meditation. Nothing in the world attracts them. And there's Gopkumar, he's come here to Tapaloka and he, 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 his desire is to see the Supreme Lord. But he couldn't find it, he couldn't, he couldn't satisfy this desire. And just by being in the company of all the sages, gradually he, he's losing the desire, his desire to see the Lord is becoming less and less. Anyway, Gopkumar stayed there for some time. He was attracted by the power of the living entity, the people there. Gopakumar and he kept on chanting his mantra because he wanted to re respect the order of his guru. And he wants, he knows how powerful the mantra was. It, it was working for him. So he wanted to keep using it. So the atmosphere, just being on Tapaloka, it, it caused Gopkumar to have less interest in seeing the Lord. But still he kept chanting his japa. His guru had ordered him never stop chanting. So Gopakumar didn't want to disobey the orders of his guru. Gopakumar didn't want to Okay, so we'll stop here today. Any questions? Yes? Uh
，他还是一直在念诵，天天都在念诵。嗯、呃，八点半嗯上班，他以前八点半九点上班，八点半才起床，现在念诵，呃四点半五点多我们就起了。他也很认真，但是每次几个月了都四次，呃艾克达西，他就就要去输液，就每次进入就要输液。就他不吃这个，你不吃这个。他问我，这怎么我回答不出来？他提到过。啊，刘先生，你有发现题？嗯，题呃，男的还是女的？男的。男的啊，他以前吃肉，后来不吃了。还是一直要吃肉，只是爱他他就不吃。他努力的吃了三天素，吃了就倒了，不就去输液了。<笑> This 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 man, he is meat eating. Um, but um, every ikada say he, he ikada say he doesn't eat things, right? He eats meat. 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 Every ikata say he would only eat some vegetable, cooked vegetable, and some peanuts, and uh, because this new new people, he he is uh, also chanting his japa, and he's seeing the example of devotees. So he is uh, um, getting up at four o'clock in the morning to chant, uh, but uh, because he is very strict in ikata say, so he said. If he didn't eat meat, he would feel pain in the stomach. But every ikadasi, he would be try to be very strict vegetarian and only eat boiled vegetable and peanut. Then he will go to out the hospital um, to to go to the hospital to do some uh, um, injection, no, not injection, but some uh, diao diao shu ye. Trips, yeah, trips. Uh, it's already, uh, already four four times. So, uh, so he is puzzled why this happened to to him. What happened? To him? Uh, he had to go to the hospital to do to have some trips. Uh. Why it happened to him? Because he's a meat eater. Just because he eats meat. Just because he eats meat. 他不吃了，他去了三天，又去输液去了，没办法，<笑>我们不知道怎么回答，叫他不吃。Oh, he, um, for three days, um, he he didn't eat meat, and then on the fourth day, he went into hospital to do trips. Three days, not enough. <笑>三天，三天戒戒三天肉是还太短，时间不。戒了三天他就倒了，就输液去了。他也想坚持，他想做做不了。Not eating properly. 嗯。让我们问我们怎么办？我们月亮怕不说，因为他的饮食啊，他的饮食不正确，他的饮食。Not the right balance. 他的那个饮饮食结构啊是不平衡的，他不知道怎么正确吃。他应该吃更多的蛋白质，不是肉类的蛋白质，而是来自其他的素食的蛋白质。比如说，嗯，坚果类啊，还是还有豆类中提取就是蛋白质。那那我们就是说，还是给他讲，嗯，这个艾克达西还是继续记，所以就换过方式。他平常也吃肉吗？他平时也是，因为刚念嘛，我们刚。他念多长时间了？可能有两个月嘛。两个月。啊 ，He has been chanting for two months. 嗯、mm. ，And he's trying to get up early to do japa and try to trying to be vegetarian. But problem is, whenever he will try to eat those vegetable and peanuts. He will fall down and has to go to the hospital. Well, what can we say? People have to be serious. If he wants to 
practice Krishna consciousness, he has to practice all the principles. Just because he observes the codice and he does everything else, all sinful things, all the other days, it's not going to get any benefit from the codice. The real purpose of Akadasi is to increase hearing and chanting. Would, would not we're not training people in fasting. We're educating people to hear and chant. About Krishna conscious, about Krishna's topics. We are training people to to somebody is observing a courtesy and eating meat all the rest of the month, it's useless. Hmm. Oh, he said he will feel the stomach is uncomfortable if he didn't eat meat. <laughs> Tell him the animals he's killed also felt uncomfortable. <laughs> doesn't he feel any comfort? Doesn't he feel have any feeling for them? Yetan Pushu Chipuzo 没 ask how can I answer her uh, his uh, doubt? Um, should I tell him to increase his chanting um, or to try to force himself to stop eating meat? Well, yes, he ha he have he has to understand that so long as he's eating meat, he cannot make any progress in spiritual practice. 他要明白一点，他只要一天还在吃肉，就不能在灵灵性生活上取得。You say he's chanting Hare Krishna, so tell him to keep chanting, and if he keeps chanting, either he will stop eating meat, or one day he will stop chanting Hare Krishna. 嗯，那您刚才说他现在在念诵 Hare Krishna，那您告诉他继续念 Hare Krishna。那么结果就是两种结果，一种是他放弃肉食，一种是他放弃念诵哈尔克什诺。他是想念诵，就是我想问。
，呃，怎么样就说继续念诵，慢慢就不吃肉了，还是呃强行戒掉就是，就是。苦鲁已经回答了，嗯、就是继续念诵，继续念诵哈，对，慢慢就不吃，因为他很痛苦，痛苦的。好，嗯，对，嗯嗯，今天苦鲁的课程当中就听起来好像可怕可骂。他要去到那个塔帕星球都是要那么的遵守不容易。那我今天的问题就是关于在我们这个时代怎么去定义遵守呢？你看像我们这些现在单身出来的，尤其是妈塔级特别多。我们现在都知道，一旦进入婚姻就是一个坑。但是呢，如果留在原生的家庭跟父母孩子在一起，或者是单独一个人生活遇到应急情况，你身边没有奉献者，是很难保证在关键时刻想起会是哪。我们是不是应该？我咕噜说祝福我们，然后来一个就是相当于难民的帕大吉，然后集中在一起生活，就像我们这种集体生活，更好的去<笑>去保证我们的这个灵修和遵守呢？还有就是 ，So just now we we heard about the, the situation in Tapaloka. Hmm. So they are very strict in their their uh brahmacharya life, but for us. A uh, single woman, it's very difficult to live with the family, parents, and children, child, uh, live with the family. On the other hand, we are uh, single. If we live, live um, by ourselves uh, all alone, there are no devotee around. Um, so, what will happen if there are some uh, urgency happen? So, Guru Guru Mahar, may you um, can can you bless us? So there will be a um, ashram so that those all the, all of us uh, single women devotee can live us uh, live together. Well, we're not trying to follow the four kumaras. Oh. You can see uh, the twelve Mahajans are our authorities and devotional service. And of the twelve Mahajans, Many are in family life. 我们看到这十二位马哈赞，呃的当中呢，许多都是有有家庭生生活的。Lord Shiva has a family. 主希瓦他是有家庭。Lord Brahma has a family. 主布拉玛也有家人。嗯。Huh? Pralad Maharaj also is in family life. Pralad Maharaj 也有他的家庭生活。So, it's not that you have to follow the four kumaras. So, it's not that you have to follow the four kumaras. So, it's not that you have to follow the four kumaras. Lord Chaitanya's associates, most of them are were in family life. Even the Lord Chaitanya's most of them were in family life. Even the Lord Chaitanya's most of them were in family life. Even the Lord Chaitanya's most of them were in family life. Even the Lord Chaitanya's most of them were in family life. Even the Lord Chaitanya's most of them were in family life. Even the Lord Chaitanya's most of them were in family life. Even the Lord Chaitanya's Tapa Loka, Maha Loka, there were great sages there who were also in Grihastha life. 而且今天的课程中提到，在塔帕洛卡下面的马哈洛卡，这些伟大的圣者们，他们也都是居士。So being in family life is not a disqualification. 嗯，所以居士生活呢，并不是。呃，一个人在居士生活当中呢，他就没有资格了。It can be a great advantage. 相反呢，还是一个很大的优势呢。So you have to, you have to know how to utilize, how you have to know how to practice Krishna consciousness. 嗯，但是你得知道怎么利用这个优势，怎么利用这个优势去修习 Krishna 之觉。Yes. Any questions online? 在网上有没有问题？点这。点关于咕噜和所有封印的，请问家里人是不吃素的，为了怕把不洁的食物供奉给主。早上又因为赶时间上班，早上供奉时只供奉独拉十叶，请问这样做妥当吗？感恩咕噜。我
this is to Guru and all the devotees. Um, may I ask, uh, Guru, my family member is not vegetarian mm. because I'm afraid to offer unclean food to the Lord. And also because I'm in a hurry to go to job. So in the morning, I only offer two CDs. Is that, is that proper? Thank you. Yes, it's okay. 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 Obviously, to Kumar, may I ask why Baba Kumar will decrease his um, attachment to the Lord on Tapaloka? His uh, remembrance of the Lord on Tapaloka. Why? Ah, uh, yes. Well, because on Tapaloka their process is practicing remembrance of the Lord. In the Tapaloka, they have a practice of remembering the Lord. They are engaging in Astanga Yoga. They are engaging in Astanga Yoga. And as we heard, they are all in Samadhi. So how do you get to Samadhi? Uh, you have to go through the preliminary stages of the Astanga Yoga. So the Astanga Yoga begins with the rules and regulations, the Yama and Niyama. And then it's asana and pranayama, the exercises and the breathing control. And then after that, then it's all different stages of meditation and concentration. Pratyahara. Internalizing all the feelings. Pratyahara, 将所有的嗯情感收摄回来 You don't. You're not. You're not thinking of anything around you. Your only consciousness is within. 把所有的收摄感官，把并把所有的注意力从外界收摄到内在 And then Dharana. Totally focusing the concentration to the, the on the soul. 把所有注意力都专注在灵魂上。And then dhyana, meditation, remembering the form of the super soul. 下一步是 dhyana， 想着主的超灵的形象。And then finally samadhi, where the mind is totally fixed. 最后一步是 samadhi， 所心意全然的专注。So Gop Kumar will discuss about the the comparison between Astanga Yoga and Bhakti Yoga. He will dis discuss they will they will discuss which is better. Is it easier to just concentrate on the soul, or is it better to do devotional service? 嗯，所以 Gop Kumar 他们。将要进行的讨论就是哪一个更呃更为好更好哪个途径是专注于呃把心意专注于超灵身上呢，还是从事于奉爱服务 ？So their process is simply remembering the Lord. 他们的方法是只是一味的单单一的是在意念着想着主。Our process is serving. 我们的方法是服务。But sometimes we're serving, we're not thinking of the Lord. But sometimes we're serving, we're not thinking of the Lord. But sometimes we're serving, we're not thinking of the Lord. But sometimes we're serving, we're not thinking of the Lord. But sometimes we're serving, we're not thinking of the Lord. But sometimes we're serving, we're not thinking of the Lord. But sometimes we're serving, we're not thinking of the Lord. But sometimes we're serving, we're not thinking of the Lord. But sometimes we're serving, we're not thinking of the Lord. But sometimes we're serving, we're not thinking of the Lord. But sometimes we're serving, we're not thinking of the Lord. But sometimes we're serving, we're not thinking of the Lord. But sometimes we're serving, we're not thinking of the Lord. But somet
They're not doing anything. It's all activity is all internalized. So in this way, Gokumar was increasing his remembrance of the Lord. So the question is that uh, um, may I ask whether the association uh, associate of Lord will make a mistake? Um, because uh, I remember one of the associates of Lord Chaitanya, he had a, um, he looked at a female devotee in a, in a very last thing. Then Lord Chaitanya uh, rejected. drove her away, drove this uh, association away. And what, what is the meaning of this her lila? What, what what is the meaning? What's the purpose? Well, the purpose is to sh teach us that we should not be a hypocrite. <laughs> Lord Chaitanya was not against people being in family life. Uh, and indeed, when one of the devotees, when he saw that one of the devotees' wife was carrying a child, Lord Chaitanya gave the name for the baby. But when somebody who was in the dress of a sannyasi was associating in a, a wrong way with the other woman, with the woman, then Lord Chaitanya was very upset and he rejected him. So that, that was being a hypocrite to take, put the dress of a sannyasi but to associate with the other sex. So this is a hypocrite. So that's the lesson. Okay. So, uh, may I ask uh, if Krishna have the similar rasa with Vasudeva and Devaki in the spiritual world? And also, are they, uh, does Krishna also have the relationship with uh, Nanda and Yashoda, the same relationship in the spiritual world? Yes. Mm, Shida. Mm. Vasudeva and Devaki are Krishna's mother and father in Dwarka. Vasudeva and Devaki are Krishna's mother in But in Vrindavan, Krishna's mother and father are Nanda and Yashoda.
to and any doesn't you share so, obeisance to Guru, Guru may ask how, how to apply Krishna consciousness in our daily life and in the uh, dealing in our dealing with family members. How to offer offer everything, every result in our family life to Lord Krishna. Well, you can do that by chanting Hare Krishna. And serving the devotees. So those two things, you chant Hare Krishna and serve the devotees. Mm. So in uh, in our daily life, we offer whatever we eat to Krishna, but in the holy dam. The, the the residents there they offer whatever Krishna likes to Krishna, so um, so that's our of offering counted as devotional service. We hope so. <laughs> Krishna in Vrindavan may eat something, but when Krishna's Krishna's everywhere, so he's also in. Your place in Baoji, he's also there, and he's in uh, Hong Kong, and so he he will eat what's ever available in these places. Krishna not only in the temple, he is also in Baoji, he is also in Hong Kong. So, the temple can be easily obtained the food that he wants to eat. Hmm. And because in Italy, Krishna will eat spaghetti. Ruga need to yingo, yingo then may tend to 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 do. In English, to do, okay. Uh, the new the new faculty when they offer food they only chant panchatattva prayer and chant Hare Krishna Ma mantra three times. Is that of offering Krishna or the accept or is that counted as prasadam? Yes, if you offer it with love and devotion. It's not just chanting the prayers, but it's the mood in which you chant. If you chant with love and you're calling Krishna to eat, then Krishna will accept. Mm, 在做在供奉，如果我们怀着奉爱，邀请Krishna来吃，Krishna就会接受。OK。下一个问题是零，禀拜咕噜，请问咕噜为什么库马尔斯兄弟最初觉悟到非人格犯的概念，而不是直接做
they were they were more attracted to the Brahman. There are different kinds of devotees. Some devotees are in Shantaras, like the four Kumaras. So they they appreciate the opulence of the Lord, but they're not engaged in devotional service. Hmm. Their their attraction is simply to the impersonal future. They had not yet met the Lord. Later on, when they meet the Lord, then they're more attracted. Hmm. Okay. Are you a No, no more question. No more question. Okay. Jintian Maman Jang Dao Guru Mani, Ki Rui, Tuan Jiao Shen Li. Recording stopped. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.